Welcome to Infigyan my dear friends. In this video we are going to take up one very interesting and challenging quartic equation problem. Question is x plus 2 times x plus 3 times x plus 4 times x plus 5 plus x plus 1 times x plus 6 equal to 6. We have to find out all four solutions. So let's get started by considering one manipulation step. I will consider these two terms all together and these two terms all together. Then we will take product. So let me write in this order first x plus 2 times x plus 5 times x plus 3 times x plus 4 and second bracket I will consider the product. So it will become x square plus 6x plus x plus 6 equal to 6. We can, we can cancel these two 6. Now I will take the product of these two and I will take the product of these two brackets. So let's get, I will write x square plus 5x plus 2x plus 10 in first bracket. In second bracket we can write x square plus 4x plus 3x plus 12. After that we are having x square plus 7x equal to 0. Now it will give us x square plus 7x plus 10 and second bracket will have x square plus 7x again plus 12 plus x square plus 7 equal to 0. Now we will give substitution. Substitution would be x square plus 7x let x square plus 7x equal to a. So once I will substitute this value in the equation it will become here I am going to write a, here I will write a and here also we can write a. So it will become a plus 10 times a plus 12 plus a equal to 0. Let's expand a square plus 12a plus 10a plus 10 times 12 120 plus a equal to 0 or we can write a square plus 22a plus a so 23a plus 120 equal to 0. So we have one quadratic equation where a our substitution is x square plus 7x. Let's solve this quadratic first. So I will write a square plus 23a plus 120 equal to 0. Let's solve using factorization. So we can find out the factors of 120. Then we can split our middle term as, as we know 120 is 15 times 8. And if I will add both. If I will add both, then it is 23, which is our middle term. So I can write a square plus 15a plus 8a. This is our 23a plus 120 equal to 0. So now from first two term, I will write again 15a and then I will consider 8a plus 120 equal to 0. Take a common from first two. So a a plus 15. 8 common from last two. a plus 15 once again equal to 0. I can take a plus 15 overall common. So in bracket it would be a plus 8 left. So from here we can write a equal to negative 8 and a equal to negative 15. So we will solve after putting our substitution a was x square let me write here x square plus 7x. So I can frame two equation a equal to minus 8 and with a equal to minus 15. So let us find out our solution. 
So I will write x square plus 7x equal to minus 8. x square plus 7x equal to minus 15. Take all the term to one side x square plus 7x plus 8 equal to 0. And second equation x square plus 7x plus 15 equal to 0. Let's apply quadratic formula. So I will write x is equal to minus b. So minus 7 plus minus under the root b square. So it will give us minus plus 7 square. So that is 49 minus 4ac. So I will write 32 divided by 2a. So 2 minus 7 plus minus 49 minus 32, it is 17. So I will write a square root 17 over 2. So from here we are having two real solutions. Minus 7 plus a square root 17 over 2. And second real solution is minus 7 minus a square root 17 over 2. Now I will solve the remaining quadratic equation to find out other two solutions. And that equation is x square plus 7x plus 15 equal to 0. x square plus 7x plus 15 equal to 0. Again, I will use quadratic formula minus b. So minus 7 plus minus under the root b square. So 49 minus 4ac. So minus 60 divided by 2a, so 2 times 1, that is 2. Now I will consider minus 7 plus minus. This will become 49 minus 60. So it will become negative 11 over 2. Now we know that the square root of negative 1 is complex number i. So I will use here, we can write it as minus 7 plus minus square root of minus 1 square root of 11 over 2. Now I will use square root of minus 1 equal to i. So we can write minus 7 plus minus i square root 11 over 2. So here two complex solutions. So two complex solutions and two real solutions. So let me write our solution. x is equal to Real one is minus 7 plus minus square root 17 over 2. Real solutions and complex solutions minus 7 plus minus i square root 11 over 2. I hope you will like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget friends to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.